I'm actually going to be doing YouTube, but I don't know if I'm going to be in it like myself. But I'm going to be Oh my god, I never hit play that whole time. Uh -uh. <laughs> Are you... I'm no, you so serious, I just turned it on. <laughs> What's up, YouTube? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <coughs> seriously, it's like a running theme. Thing. I know, <laughs> seriously, a running theme for my channel. Hi, YouTube, I just went through this whole tangent. Maybe I should drink a little more coffee. <laughs> oh my god. So the, as I was saying, YouTube, this is my ride or die bitch. <laughs> She's badass makeup artist. Jessica Saint. If you haven't heard of her, you probably should crawl out no, from no, underneath. No, no. I'm not gonna say the other word. <laughs> If you don't know, now you know. <laughs> Nutella. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyways, I'm back in Philly. I'm really sorry I haven't posted anything. I've just been kind of, like, dealing with some personal legal issues with custody and stuff like that. Um, we are stuck in a governmentless state right now in New Jersey. And what we call shore traffic because this is purge traffic this is the purge traffic everybody's running out to oh, uh, their hiding places um yeah my friend posted on facebook and wrote hashtag the purge <laughs> new jersey has no government i don't even really know what's going on so i probably shouldn't talk about it because i'm gonna piss somebody off but um yeah, we're going to the lake today, and you know, in and you know, and you know, in New Jersey, they don't call it going to the beach. It's down, down the shore. Down the shore. It's not even down the shore. It's down the shore. Down the shore. We're going down the shore. So we're going to. But we're going to the lake. We're not going down the shore. We're going down the shore <laughs> to close to the shore. <laughs> close to the shore. By the sea, by the sea, by the beautiful sea. To a man-made lake. To a man-made lake, where my mind can be free. We. And it will be. Good, Jess. That was a good one. I just need to point out how awesome my outfit is today. I'm wearing this hat that I got at Five Below. We just stopped. I got these sunglasses. Buy one, get one free. Jess can get a pair too. But you're not wearing yours. No, because I have to take the things off. <laughs> ah. Okay. Yeah, I gotta take but I got, off. I got my Star Wars John on, and my rainbow socks, and my Chuck Taylors. You might want to explain John to people. Oh, John. <laughs> so, J-A-W-N. Literally means everything. And anything. Everything and anything. So, like, this car, for example, it's is, my John. is her John, her I'm new John, John <laughs> her new car John. We, we riding in this John. I'm drinking this John. This coffee's my John. This coffee is my John. No, it's your John. Mm -hmm. But you got me turned on to you, John. This, yeah, this is the, jo the John. I mean, I could make an entirely separate vlog just on the word John. John. Just explaining that word. Exactly. Like, that's totally a thing. Mm -hmm. And, um, I don't know why it's really weird to me that we're getting off on exit 13. I keep thinking that, like, today is so beautiful and it's such a good day. It reminds me of, like, a premise of, like, one of those really fucked up horror movies. No! <laughs> <laughs> the lake, people! <laughs> or, like, it does get kind of scary there. Like, if we're, if we're there a little too long and it gets kind of dark, it, that's, it does get super, like, creepy. Does it? So we leave, we always make sure to leave at a certain time. <laughs> we're like, fuck that noise! <laughs> I wonder if this is near where all the ghost stories that my dad used to tell me yes, about. Yes, there are a lot. This is the Pine Barrens and shit. Where oh, like we're going all, to the Pine Barrens? Oh, yeah, yeah. Ooh. This is like... There's the pine Jersey leaves in the Pine... Yeah, the Jersey... I used like, to go hunting for the Jersey the hills have eyes there. bullshit. No, they call them pineys. Yeah, I know. But that's... I, I call... I say the hills have eyes bullshit because that's, you know... So, you know... Very similar. If 
you don't hear from us by tomorrow, then that means we got eaten by either the Jersey Devil or some pineys or the Pine Barrens. I don't know if you know this. I've done a lot of studying on the Pine Barrens because when I was a kid, my family used to have um, a camp out in a hunting lodge um, in the Pine Barrens and it was father-daughter weekend and all of the dads would take all the daughters because I have a huge family. So it's um, my dad's a middle child of seven kids and um, he has brothers and sisters, mostly brothers and three sisters and four brothers. So, um, you know, and then we have cousins and aunts and uncles and tons of fucking guys. My family's fucking huge. But, um, so they would take us out to the Pine Barrens and we would just sit and eat like really good food in the hunting cabin. And they would take us deep, deep, deep into the Pine Barrens. And at least two or three of the dads would stay behind and get made up into the Jersey Devil. Oh, Jesus Christ. And at the time, this is when Freddie and Jason came out. And I was like maybe four years old, three or four years old. And I think this is where my love of horror and slash hack, hack, hack and special effects, makeup, zombie shit came into play because my dad was always fucking with me. And we would go out into the Pine Barrens and we would go with like a group leader who obviously knew what was going on. And I was on someone's shoulder. And to this day, my cousins still make fun of me for this. I would say, I said, don't go up there, you're all gonna die! <laughs> and of course they all jumped out dressed like the Jersey Devil and Jason and everything else, and I believed it was real until I got to be the Jersey Devil one day, and my inner child made me feel so guilty. I was like, we're going to hell because we're scared of a bunch of three-year-olds. <laughs> I can't do this. I got really drunk beforehand, but it was hilarious. And my niece, to this day, still believes that it's real. And she's 16 now. So, well, that's the Dirty Devil, and that is, uh, but the Pine Barrens. There are some legends in the Pine Barrens that, um, certain parts are, like, Bermuda Triangle-y. And if you go over, there's, like, the seven bridges in the Pine Barrens, and if you go over all seven bridges, you're supposed to, like, disappear. Did you know that? No. Never heard of that one? No. I don't know somebody that said they'd been over all five, but they were looking for the last few, and um, I always thought that that was really interesting folklore. All right, well, we're up to about eight minutes on this video. I try not to go past ten, and I hope you guys subscribe, like, and if you subscribe. Hit the ding ding, the notification bell. Notification bell. Stay pretty. Bye. Say bye. Bye.